Welcome to today's practice. I'm Summer. Today we're going to do some short and direct sun salutations to move energy for a couple of minutes in your day. I promise you this will change your state. This is a mood enhancer and energizer. It can be modified if you wish to have two blocks handy. These are not necessary but can be lovely to raise the ground up a little bit and sometimes even give you just a softer experience. So those are optional, but be sure to subscribe to the channel so you never miss any of the three brand new classes we release every single week. We try to make home practice really doable, really easy, and even quite fun for you to incorporate into your daily routines. So welcome, we'll get started in a comfortable seat. You can choose to sit in any cross-leg position. Do take a moment to reach under your seat and widen, pull back and apart through the sitting bones. Your pelvis can tip forward and up. Please close your eyes and take a moment to put down everything you've been doing leading up to this moment. Breathe and feel your body as if you're taking a photo, a little snapshot of this moment. And in this way, you check in and honor how you're feeling today, how your physical form is, how your breath pattern is, how your mood, your emotional state is. Just a moment of checking in, allowing things to be as they are and noticing them is a powerful, powerful way we begin our practice. And then we notice the power of the practice as we check in at the end. Plant a little seed if you wish. What energy do you want to bring forward with you through your day? What do you want to call in and feel or remember what matters most to you? Make the practice your own. Make it a devotional practice for yourself. Take a full breath in. Fill your lungs all the way. Let it all go. Blink your eyes open again, fill your lungs, but incorporate your arms to move with that inhale up and overhead in a big circle. Hold at the top. Turn your palms down and lower them. Exhale as you let the breath go. One more just like that. Inhale. Like a plant, reach out of your roots, out of your pelvis, stretch up, open your body, hold at the top. Exhale, arms come down with the breath. Come all the way to standing. So right out of the gate, we're sinking up breath and movement. With feet hip bone distance, inhale. Arms reach and circle, hold one beat. Exhale, arms down. Imagine your clock. Now inhale up to one o'clock and 11. Exhale down, two o'clock and 10, inhale. Reach out to your fingertips and then flip your palms, exhale down, three and nine. Reach, reach, reach and exhale down, four and eight o'clock. Exhale down, five and seven. Exhale down, inhale, circle all the way up and come to the top of the mat. Flip your fingers to interlace palms up. Full stretch for a moment. You can wiggle a little bit to get some lift and length. And then keep reaching up like you're lifting the sky up. Press down to your feet. Give a little firm hug to your legs. Lengthen your tail to your heels. Slow exhale, swan dive forward so you can have bent or straight legs. And this is where I'm going to Put my blocks here so you can see what that looks like if you choose this option. With hands either on the floor or the blocks, inhale halfway lift and lengthen and exhale and bow. Let's do it with bent knees. Inhale, look forward, lengthen, find space in your waistline, your whole spine. Keep bent knees and fold. Next inhale, left leg steps back to lunge. Then lower your back knee, keep the toes tucked. Take a breath, move the pelvis forward and down, nice and slow to begin. 
And then inhale, torso upright, arm circle back around and up. Look up. Inhale. Exhale, arm circle back around and down to the blocks. Exhale. Place your palms flat on the floor or blocks. Downward dog. Inhale forward, plank pose, holding. Push through your hands, firm your legs, and lift the back of the head. First option here, lower your knees. Keep the shoulders on the back as you exhale, lower to the floor. Point your toes. Inhale your back bend, keeping the pelvis and legs down. Stretch them long. Next, exhale, lower your chest. Inhale to hands and knees. Tuck your toes. Exhale, downward dog. Look forward, inhale your left leg forward. Lower your right knee down, take a breath, pelvis forward. Circle the arms back around and up as you lift your torso. If you can, palms touch, look up. And exhale, hands down, lift your back knee, inhale, step forward, lengthen, look halfway. So either bent or straight legs and then fold over your legs. Bent knees, arch your low back to rise and stand. Circle the arms around and up. Exhale, hands to the heart. Release your arms. Inhale, circle the arms back around and up here. Get a little more shoulder mobility. And swan dive forward, circle the arms. Inhale, open halfway. Exhale, this time right leg back. Nice high lunge, lower your knee. Inhale, circle the arms. Reach up, look up. Exhale, circle the arms back around and down. Plank pose this time. Keep the lifting the back of the body up. Scoop the tail more to the heels. And then either lower your knees as before or rock forward on your toes. Exhale, lower mindfully, shoulders back. Point the toes, inhale, pull the body a little forward on the mat to curl into your back bend. And this time, push up to all fours, tuck your toes. Exhale, downward facing dog. You can always modify if I give a cue that doesn't work for you. Transition in the way that works best. Next, inhale, step the right leg forward. Left knee down, pelvis forward here. Create boundaries, hug in. And then inhale, circle the arms back around and up. Breathe in. Exhale, circle the arms back around and down. Breathing out, lifting your left knee, high lunge. Inhale, step the left foot to meet the right. Feet two fists distance, look forward and fold. Inhale, root your feet down, rise and stretch up. Exhale, hands to the heart, picking it up. Inhale, reach. Exhale, bow. Inhale, half lift. Step or hop, downward facing dog. Keep toes tucked, wave through, upward dog. Hover your thighs, arms are straight, shoulders back. And downward facing dog all the way. Look forward, right foot, then left foot to the top. Lengthen halfway, fold. Inhale, press down to rise, stretch up. Exhale, swan dive forward. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale again, step or hop, downward dog. Keep your toes tucked, wave all the way into your back bend. Upward dog, you can always lower your thighs, bend your arms a little if you need. Exhale, downward dog. Take another breath, move your hips and thighs back. Bend the knees, look forward, left foot, then right foot steps forward, lengthen and bow. Root down, stand up, reach up. Exhale, dive forward, folding in. Inhale, open and lengthen the spine halfway. Plant the hands, step or hop, downward dog. All the way through your wave-like motion into your back bend. All the way to wave back to downward facing dog. Inhale, the right leg up. Next, inhale, bend the knee, open the hip. As your foot drops to the left, bend both knees. And then as you straighten both legs, big stretch, push even through your hands. We'll do that two more times. Bend both knees, gather in. Exhale, big expansion out like a starburst. One more, bend, 
expand. Plant the right foot down. You can either stay in dog, three breaths, or inhale all the way into your back bend. Exhale all the way back to your dog pose. Inhale, left leg up. Next, inhale, bend the knee, open the hip, lift your shin. Bend both legs, inhale. Exhale, straighten both legs, big starburst. Inhale, gather, 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 get strong. Exhale, reach out and away, get long. Last one, bend. Biggest yet, expand. Look forward, step your left foot all the way between the hands. Step your right foot, lengthen and bow. Root and rise. Last one, fold. Half lift. Plant the hands, hop or jump, downward dog. Inhale all the way into your back bend. Exhale, downward facing into child's pose. Lower your knees, let your big toes come to touch and really lengthen, lengthen back to sink to your heels. Arms overhead, relaxed. Forehead grounding either to mat or props. Slow breath. This is known as child's pose, also as pranam, which is a bow of humility. A bow of offering. Pra means to place forth, to make an offering. What is it that you're going to carry with you off this little rectangle? What do you feel now as you take your snapshot, your check-in? How does this practice stimulate you to come back home to your body, your breath? Always know wherever you go, whatever's happening around you, you're at home, you can return home. These simple tools of building mindful attention, Movement with breath. Stay here as long as you wish. Thank you so much for joining me on the mat for this sacred little window of a practice today. We'll see you again next time. Leave your comments. Thank you for being here, being part of this vibrant community. Have a beautiful rest of day.